So over here, you can see that I am in the quick view right now. So if I were to go around onto the expert view, you can see that I have this timeline and I have this media uh, section right here where I can go around and preview things. But um, uh, in a professional environment, you may actually have two monitors to work with as well. And in Adobe Premiere Elements and Expert Mode, you can actually split the timeline and the main workspace into two screens as well. So to do that, not on the quick view. On the quick view, you don't have this effect right here. But if I were to go around over here onto Expert Mode right here, then under Windows, you can see that Dual Monitor Workspace is an option right here. And once you do that, the timeline gets separated as you can see right here. So now what you can do is the timeline, you can go around and push it out onto a second monitor if you have it right here. And then you can work around with the main um, main uh, media right here and then you can work around with the timeline on a separate space but if you want to go around and keep it back again you can go around right here just like this so instead of dual monitor you can restore out workspace and um, the workspace that is the timeline gets back onto the space again and over here, you can see that you can go around and change around the space of the timeline right here as well by clicking and dragging. And over here, you can see that this is what you have. You can go around and pull this in right here to change this um, and make uh, a bit of adjustments onto the, um, onto the workspace just like this. And that is how you can enable and disable the dual monitor workspace inside of expert mode in Adobe Premiere Elements. So hope you guys learned something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.